We all buy auto insurance, hoping never to get in a car accident. Egg freezing really should be thought of in a similar fashion. Egg freezing is an insurance policy. I applaud women who want to freeze their eggs. They are being proactive, trying to ensure that they have success in all that they want in life. That's great. And our technologies nowadays are good and will really help them along their path. But I'm also anxious for women when they go to freeze their eggs. I want people to freeze eggs and maybe never use those eggs. I'm nervous that if a 25 year old freezes her eggs and comes back to me at 40, if her eggs don't work, she may have to use an egg donor. Yes, she's more likely if she freezes them at age 25 that they will work, but we're freezing eggs and not guaranteeing fertility. What if the sperm aren't good? What if those eggs don't survive? We really don't know. We only know that we have eggs in the freezer. So there are a lot of unknowns. I encourage women to plan their life. It's important to be proactive and thoughtful about what you want out of life. I encourage women to consider freezing their eggs. And if they freeze them in their 20s and early 30s, there's a high likelihood that they'll be able to make lots of eggs and those eggs will be of good quality. But it's not a guarantee. I've had women come to me even at 30 and we check their ovaries and check their hormones. Financially, it is not feasible for them to truly freeze their eggs. Some women at 30, maybe even in their 20s, have diminished ovarian reserve. They take fertility drugs and they only make me three or four eggs. That's not really a guarantee of success. We really need a good 25 eggs in the freezer to feel comfortable that one egg is gonna survive. It's crazy. Mathematical statistics tell us it takes 100 eggs to make one baby. When we look at pregnancy rates, those are 25% per month. So yes, young women can make lots of eggs, but not all those eggs are normal. Not all those eggs are gonna survive the freeze-thaw, not all those eggs are gonna fertilize, and not all those eggs may make it to blast. We put 25 eggs in a freezer. We'll probably get one embryo, to transfer. If we have a nice embryo, she's got a great chance that that will work. But what if she doesn't have a good embryo? If she's waited till she was 40 or 45 to come back and use those embryos, she's going to be sad. Those embryos won't work. And then she's wasted 20, 25 years of her life because she thought she banked success. It's such a complicated decision. Do I freeze? When do I freeze? Do I try and start a family? What if I'm single? Do I do it by myself? There are so many issues. It's a complicated decision to make. I can't tell you what's right for you. I think now that it's an option, people should consider it. But realistically, the time to freeze is in your early 20s. And most women aren't even thinking about fertility at that time frame. Women in their late 30s are the ones most likely walking into my office nowadays. I freeze their eggs every day. They may have to do several cycles to get 25 eggs. Some do, some don't. Some can't afford it. I hope they're successful. I know they feel better about preserving their fertility. And that's great. I don't know what's right for you. I don't know if you want to freeze your eggs or not when you want to freeze your eggs. I know that if you start a family at 40, you might be working till 60. People often wait for financial success to start a family. And that's important, but sometimes they end up bankrolling the fertility treatments because they waited so long that it's harder to get pregnant. Very complicated decision-making process. When to have a family, when to pursue your career, when to freeze your eggs. In summary, the rules of thumb should be Age is important. The younger you are, the more eggs you'll likely make and the best quality eggs you'll probably get. And two, egg freezing should be considered an insurance policy and not a guarantee. We welcome you to come in and talk about your personal instance and why you're thinking about egg freezing.